That looked like Theris. It has been a long time since you sent him to the underworld, Arkantos. Fighting old battles again? Yes. Old enemies. I still see them here. Theris's army burned a dozen cities to the ground before he met you. Denios. You stopped him from killing everyone in Corinth. And over there is Kessos, I believe. And King Lyomedes, Aegeus the Mad, the mercenary Phytos. You have won more battles for Atlantis than can be counted, faced opponents no other man dared fight. That was long ago. Today, Atlantis's enemies live only in my dreams. I face feeble pirates now. Is that what you believe, Atlantean? Atlantis still has enemies, and you are still the one who will face them. Any who threaten my home or my family will soon have a place in my dreams. These are enemies unlike the others, Arkantos. Do not let your guard down. Dark times are coming, and you are needed. Arkantos, awaken. Admiral, sir. Yes? We've sighted land on the horizon. We should reach Atlantis soon. Excellent. It will be good to see my son Castor again. You cannot ignore the omens, Arkantos. Lord Poseidon's displeasure is clear. I do not deny his anger, but I do think there are other ways to appease him. We must help break the siege at Troy. Troops we send now will be lucky to arrive before the fight is over. Even if they do, their only task will be to show the banner of Atlantis, not a task for an admiral. It would shame Agamemnon if we sent one of your junior officers. He already complains that we do not pay enough attention to the Greek colonies. No, it must be you. What in the name of... Castor, stay here! Arcantos, by the gods! <laughs> I did not expect Mother Atlantis would send her best admiral to fight for me. Gracious words, King Agamemnon. And look at this. Ajax, I'm surprised to see you still drawing breath. These Trojan dogs keep trying, my friend. Good to see you again. Who did you upset to get sent so far from home? Well, someone had to come and help you put an end to this. None of us would need to have come to this godforsaken place if the Trojans would not have kidnapped Helen. We are honor bound to rescue her. What must be done to get her back? Helen is held behind their walls, and we've had little luck breaking through. We are about to change that. You have arrived in time for our final push, Arkantos. Get your men ashore. You can make your camp to the east, but be careful. The Trojans have some scouts in that area. When you are done, we will start preparations for our assault. Ah, and here he comes, Odysseus, a champion of Atlantis sent to fight in my army. Join us, Sorkantos. You know the famous Odysseus, surely? I know of him. Your reputation precedes you. As does yours. Are you ready for the siege? We could use your advice in planning our attack. As the commander here, I have already taken care of the plans, Odysseus. You and Arcantos will take your armies and start the siege of the gates. That's a fine start. What about the other armies? Ajax and I will keep our men in reserve. When you get through, Ajax will rush his men in to clear out the Trojan defenders. Then I will enter and rescue Helen. That is a fine plan, King Agamemnon. I'm sure Arcantos and I will have no problems. Curse Troy and those who dwell within her walls. They torched our food stores and tents. Even most of the ships will be lucky to even escape here now. Escape? We just broke down one of the gates. We should be pressing our attack, not talking of escape. Every warrior in Troy now guards the scratch we made in their defenses. And they burn most of our siege along with our camp. We cannot mount another assault. We can build more siege. The Trojans aren't going to wait for that. Surely they will attack again at any moment. Hmm. Not if they think we've given up and left. We'll have to move the ships and convince them. What if we leave them some sign of our submission? Poseidon is the lord of horses. In Atlantis, a defeated general surrenders his horse when beaten. 
A horse, yes. A great wooden horse. What? What nonsense is this? If we don't have enough time to build siege weapons, I don't see how building a great wooden horse is going to help us. I, I don't understand. Will it fight? I see now. We can have this done quickly, and we don't have to rebuild any of the siege. Arcantos, I will need your help. Where to now, Arcantos? Back to Atlantis. This was a welcome break from chasing pirates, but I need to return home. Pirates? I thought they asked you to lead the armies of Atlantis. Ages ago. Now they just ask me when I'm going to retire. There aren't many enemies Atlantis needs fought anymore. They keep me busy with the pirates. Well, pirates or not, you need to get your boats repaired. You don't think they can make it to Atlantis? No. There is a port not far from here, Ioclos. I'm sailing there. I can show you the way and get someone to work on your ships. I won't be far behind. I'm heading there as soon as King Agamemnon has Helen aboard. Then we can meet there before I sail back for Atlantis. I'll see you there. And he strides among the treetops, and is taller than the trees, and his voice through all the garden is thunder sent to bring. What is it, Kemsit? Kemos has returned, sir. He lost the trident. Did he? Poseidon said it was important that we capture that relic. Perhaps I should give Kemos easier tasks, like digging down there with the others. He says the Atlantean was headed for Troy. The battle there will not last much longer once he joins the Greeks. The siege at Troy is already over. That means the Greek armies will return soon and the Olympian gods will no longer be distracted by the fighting. Troy has kept them busy long enough. We have nothing to worry about now. Zeus could still interfere. Do you question me, Kimsit? I no, no. Everything is exactly as you said it would be. The fortress, the tunnel, Troy. I expect obedience, Kimsit. Not fear and doubt. If that's too much for you, you can join the others in the pit. Giants and the genie, multiplex of wing and eye, whose strong obedience broke the sky. Send Kamos. I want to speak with him. Yes, General. This does not look good. What happened? Hey, you there! What happened to the port? Run! More bandits! Bandits! No, you old fool. We are your own army. We return from Troy. Praise Zeus. The soldiers have returned. Yes. Now what happened here? After the army sailed for Troy, bandits attacked the city. They took our men hostage. Chiron, too. Who is Chiron? He's a wandering teacher, a holy man. He does the bidding of the gods. He said a hero would come to save us. That does not ease my mind. Perhaps we should go find him, see what he knows about this. Iaklos lies in ruin. Have hope. Your city can be restored. The bandit is an Egyptian. Why is he here? We are warriors of Set. The city is ours now. The bandit king serves an Egyptian god with strange powers. Our master has enslaved the people of this city. You are too weak to save them. If we save the Ioclos slaves, they will help us. Thank you for returning the city to us. You're welcome. We did not find the other prisoners, however. The bandits were led by a man called Kimsit. He marched the prisoners to the North Road. Those guarding us spoke of putting them to work, building something there. Should we go after him? We can't leave all the men of this town in the hands of bandits. 
We will head out to rescue your men. Can you start repairing our ships? Atlantis is going to have to deal with those pirates without you a little longer, eh? It seems that way. Ajax, gather our troops. We'll take what stores we have in the ships and whatever these people can offer. I do not know what god the Cyclops serves, but fire rains and the earth splits when he asks. They rush in red and purple, from the red clouds of the morn. From the temples where the yellow gods shut up their eyes in scorn. I will warn you, this once. You're very brave when you're killing unarmed farmers. Perhaps you'd like to come down here and test your metal against a soldier. And he saith, break up the mountains where the hermit folk can hide. Enough babbling, coward. Come face me. Atlantis does not fear the likes of you. It should. I have warned you. Continue to pursue me, and I will spare neither you, nor your city, nor your son. Remember that threat. I will have your head for that. We may be able to block this tunnel Carlos. if we can break loose this huge boulder. I am Theseus. I will assist you while you are here. So you have no idea where we are? Well, not exactly. At least we found water. Admiral. You are Greeks? No, Atlantean. There are Greeks among us. What are you doing here? We're... lost. And unlucky, too. I am Amandra. Prepare your men. We have to defend this area. Defend it against what? This oasis holds treasures beyond water. A relic is buried here. My enemies are on their way to try to take it. What does that have to do with us? Look around. Those passes are the only entrance to this oasis. Escape through them and you will run headlong into the worshippers of Set. You can choose to die there, or fight here with me. This is the relic your enemies wanted? The Sword of the Guardian, used by Horus to defeat Set once before. Now one of his followers, Kemsit, seeks to take it. Kemsit? He is your enemy? You know of him? How? If it is the same coward, he was preying on helpless Greek cities while their armies were away. And the sword? There is a guardian at the temple, but it sleeps. If we return the sword to the guardian, it will awaken. It seems the gods have smiled on us. At last. Kemsit may have escaped, but at least we have brought the peace of Osiris here. What is special about this place? It is the center of Osiris's kingdom. That is his palace. Now, I need to get the peace to Setna. Setna is already a guest of ours. And now you are too. Take them to the prison. Isis, hear my plea. I have been betrayed by a servant of Set. Send your blessing upon me, and I will have vengeance. So, Setna, all the other priests of Osiris were imprisoned too? Some were left to die in the desert. But why did he want to kill Osiris? Then you truly do not know. You always seem to hide behind something when I see you, Cyclops. You interrupted me in Greece, escaped the underworld, and arrived here before me. There is no way you did this on your own. 
I will know which gods support you. Now! Lord Poseidon watches over all the people of Atlantis. Lord Poseidon? <laughs> You're more a fool than I expected. Let's see if he's watching over you now. Excellent. Now I can stop you all out at once. You may feel less like fighting after I pull off your head. I will deal with you all in due time. We have more pressing matters to attend to at Osiris's pyramid. Zeus cannot interfere directly or it will touch off a war amongst all the gods. That is why you are here. Make no mistake, if Kronos escapes, this will be Atlantis. And all you love will be lost. Arcados, are you all right? Yes, just a bad dream. Come, join us. It is time to plan our attack. <laughs> Let me make sure I understand. Osiris's pyramid guards another passage to the underworld? Yes, Osiris's throne sits atop the gate. If he regains his throne, the way will be blocked and none may pass. And to revive Osiris, we must return the pieces of his body to the pyramid? Yes, if we can reunite the body of Osiris, he will live again. We have one piece. There are three more which must be found and brought here. Isis has made their locations clear to me, but Set guards them all. I do not know if there is time to recover them before Gargarensis reaches the gate. We have to split up. Amonra, you, Chiron, and I will divide our forces and recover the other pieces. Ajax, you come with me. May Isis guide us. And Athena as well. North of here, a great tamarisk tree grows from the riverbank. In its trunk, we will find the head of Osiris. Chiron, soldiers approach! What manner of men are these? Half man and half horse. This is a strange land indeed. Who are you? I am Niord Seer. We're following the One Eye. We've tracked him all the way from Midgard. The One Eye? Gargarensis? The Cyclops? Aye, he has united the giants up north. Much of Midgard now lies in ruin. We were sent to follow him in hopes of preventing Ragnarok. Ragnarok? The end of the world. Have you seen the One Eye? He is here. We are fighting against him as well. Will you join us? We will. The passage to Erebus is open! Rack! Starboard side! That ship belongs to Odysseus. From the looks of it, Poseidon hasn't been kind to him. Bring us around. We'll go ashore and see if there's any sign of him. <coughs> if Odysseus landed here, at least he's eating well. Ajax, wait. The pigs. They don't look... Something is wrong. Praise Zeus! Oh, that was horrible! We're free! The curse has been lifted! I'm human again! I thought I'd end my days as a pig on this miserable island. You're lucky we spotted you. We were sailing after an enemy and just happened to sight your shipwreck. Poseidon grants me some luck. Who is this enemy you're following? A Cyclops, Gargarensis. Come on, we could use your help. I owe you for rescuing me, but I must return home. Thank you, Arkantos. You owe us nothing, friend. We can spare a ship for you and your men to sail home in.
At least Gagarensis has made his path clear. This is the pass we seek. Beyond is Midgard. I hope it is warmer in Midgard. Stand, fiend! We have found you! The north is full of tangled things, and text and aching eyes, and dead is all the innocence of anger and surprise. First the fair hair clan raids us. Now these giants come down from the hills. Keep quiet. Another giant is coming this way. What kept you? It took Arcantos longer to get to the pass than we expected. It was worth it if that meddlesome Atlantean is gone. Has Loki taken care of our opposition? Yes. There is a god who watches over these people. But Loki found the source of his strength. A hammer, and destroyed it. He has no power without it. Excellent. I may not have to kill you after all, Kemsit. Let's go. What do you think, Kitri? We're running out of time! What choice do we have? What do you think they'll want? What are you little men doing up here? Ah! Oh, y your help! We need your help. Then come out of the shadows and speak with us. Our forge has been invaded by giants. We need your army to drive them out. I'm sorry, we don't have time to help you right now. There is no one else we can ask. All the Norsemen in Midgard are already fighting giants. Wait, can you reach Midgard from your forge? Of course! Our forge is deep under the mountains and our mines go all the way through. You'll help us then? If you deliver us into Midgard. Excellent! Come, the mine entrance is this way. Are we sure we are ready? Our stolen forge will be well defended. We've got to research the dwarven technologies. Come, come. Warm yourself by old Skalt's fire. Have you seen a giant with a single eye come past, old man? If you are looking for giants, we have plenty. Ragnarok is nigh, the final battle. As soon as the Norsemen started fighting one another, all the giants came out of the hills to join in. Maybe we could convince some of these Norsemen to stop fighting each other and join us. Ah, they would kill strangers as soon as they sighted them. I don't like the sound of that. I do have the banner of my own village. If you carry it before you, they'll stop fighting long enough to hear you out. But you won't change any minds. It seems worth a try. The pass between here and the clans is full of giants. But if you promise to keep me safe from them, I'll go with you. Your walls crumble to dust before the power of the Norse gods. The Norse gods assist me, fools! Do not let the appearance fool you. The well will take us to Niflheim. I hope you're right about that. You go first, Chiron. If you fall screaming to your death, we'll just stay here. Ah! When you decide which of you will go first, I'll be waiting at the bottom. The ram has swung nine times! We must hurry! All of you, take cover! Someone is coming! Chiron was a great warrior. We will not forget his sacrifice. What do we do now? Wait, what is this? You? How did you get here? We followed you. Why didn't you just come with us? Loki. He tries to fool us. Our mission is too important to trust strangers. What mission? The hammer. Thor's hammer. The gate. What? Before Gagarensis came to the north, Loki tricked Thor and smashed his hammer. Yes, and we have been tasked with making a new one. 
I have to get the haft from a piece of the taproot. Itri has the hammer head. We are supposed to meet. And if Thor has his hammer, he will seal the gate. We should avoid the gate and the land bridge where Chiron fell. The enemy is too strong there. I told you. We should have killed Arkantos when we had the chance. Calm yourself, worm. All is not lost. What? How can all not be lost? All of the gates have been closed. We have a plan, my friend. Yes, yes. And you get to play an important part in it. What? What plan? Arkantos! Ah, uh, where are we? Midgard. Our battles are not yet over. What of the gate? The gate is closed, but we have not stopped Gagarensis. His army is heading this way. Ah, uh, that seems bad. Look! To the east! Well, here he comes. Stand brave! We will offer you a chance to surrender. If you give up now, we'll grant you a quick death. Otherwise, I promise you it will be long and painful. We surrender. Move a little closer. So be it. Odysseus is coming. He will be here soon with a great army. Odysseus? By the gods, I will be glad to see him. But he is not here yet, Arcanthus. And it will take all we have to survive Gagarensis' attacks until then. Then survive we must. Glad you changed your mind. I was almost home. Then I dreamt of my city in ruin and Athena spoke to me. I know the dream. How did you find us? Well, the horrible roar and the blinding flash of light were helpful. That was the end of this one's dream. And with that finished, I think we should find some ships. Home beckons. A fine idea. Ajax. You're sure you don't want to take him back to Atlantis? Put him in a cage somewhere. No. He'll never set foot in my homeland. Any final words before your head goes in this bag, fiend? Any poetry to share with us? This is for Chiron. Years ago, the god Hades opened four passages from the underworld in the darkest forest of the Norselands. Based on strange attacks from the undead, the location of these passages must be dangerously close to a small village where I grew up. I am Regenleaf. I have returned to my home and must lead my village in a battle to find and close these passages from Erebus. Where is Castor? Arkantos! Castor and the Theocrat are being held behind that fortress! You can destroy this city. You can set the Titans free to walk the Earth once more. But I promise you, you aren't going to live to see it. Ah! Zeus has blessed you with a Titan! It will not be enough to stop me! You are too late! <laughs> 